Hi everyone. I'm sorry I haven't updated um, in a couple weeks. I had a episode this week um, and I ended up in the hospital and I posted about that on my other channel. So if you want to check that out, you can go to my main channel here and go to the section that says other channels and go to Cal32205 and that's where I will be doing all of my you know, personal updates, rants, just my vlog. Um, and I, my most recent video explains like what I had to deal with this week, which was really, really awful. And I'm still recovering from the aftermath of it. It was just horrible. So anyways, I've been wanting to do this review. I just have not had the time, but it is for this product stain away. And this stuff is a denture cleaner. This is the bottle. This is 80 uses. I got it on eBay for um, $4.99 free shipping. That's not bad. I mean, it's a pretty, it's a pretty good sized bottle. And um, what it is is it's like it's it's to soak your teeth in. It's you soak your teeth in it. It it's powder. Uh, yeah. Let me pour a little bit more so you, it, yeah, <laughs> whatever. Okay, it's this thick powder with these little blue granules in there. It really, really looks like um, laundry detergent or like Cascade or something. It's pretty hardcore looking. And, um, I, the first time I smelt it, I couldn't tell you what it smelled like because, like, the stuff, like, went up my nose. So, like, don't put your face up to the bottle and go smelling it. It shot up my nose, and it did not feel too pleasant. So, don't do that. Trust me, it smells like chlorine. Like, just if you really feel like you have to smell it, like, I feel like I have to smell everything, just take the cap off and kind of like that. <laughs> it smells like chlorine. And, um... I imagine it works pretty much like chlorine because, like, you can see my teeth and they are very, very bright. It is not just the lighting either. I mean, this is the shade that I chose. This is the shade that I chose. I didn't get the bright, bright white shade, but this is how my teeth looked when I got them. For a while, you don't notice that your teeth are becoming stained because, like, you have your teeth every day. And, like, it just, over time, it's like it got to that point where I looked in the mirror and I was like, wow, these bad boys are pretty dingy. Like, comparing them to my whites of my eyes and stuff like that, and it just weren't looking too hot. So, I, um, I, that's when I did the bleach thing, which, really helped a lot. It really helped a lot, but it, it did not get them back to the natural, the natural, um, color that they were, the original color. Um, I thought it did until I bought this stuff because I had heard so many good things about it. Um, all of the reviews online were just like amazing for this product. And so I had to try it out because I am a, well, was a very heavy coffee drinker, smoker, like hardcore smoker, pack a day smoker, um, sodas, like you name it. And yes, I clean my teeth and stuff, but it's like, it's like with toothpaste on your natural teeth. See, that's what I think the advantage is to having dentures because you can take them out and clean them. Like you're not going to sit there and brush your natural teeth with this kind of stuff. So, um, anyways, it, it really works good. Um, you pour anywhere from a half cap full to three caps of the product, depending on how bad your teeth are. And um, you put it in whatever it is that you soak your teeth in, and then put in half a cup of hot water, and it's going to foam up. So do not fill your denture bath or whatever it is you call it. Don't fill it all the way up with water because it is very effervescent. It, oh. <laughs> it it will foam out like science project volcano foam everywhere it went all over the place um but i just did this i just 
soap vine like for about an hour and a half, hour 45 minutes before doing this video. And um, this is the result. It is amazing. So I can only imagine like how good it would look overnight. But then again, I think that that's kind of overkill because like I said, it they're they look nice. They look really nice. So I would really highly, highly, highly recommend this product, especially considering how much product you're getting. You can use it every single day and um, it actually does what it says it's going to do. And I love that about products that I buy when they do what they say they're going to do instead of just being the total opposite of what you expected. So that was money well spent. Um, I don't know what else to say about it because it's just pretty basic. Like you just soak your teeth in it and um, that, that's about it. Uh, I found a bonus use for it. Sunday night, um, well, I was, I get so excited about my son starting school back up again because it's like I kind of live through my kids. So when he goes to school, like I'm dressing him up in all these cool clothes and shoes and doing his hair and like, you know, talk about how cool he is and stuff like, cause I don't know, whatever. <laughs> anyway, so during my, um, my nightly grooming of my son before school, it's like a ritual. I realized that I have really been neglecting his fingernails. So I, um, I thought about it. Like, that was the first thing I thought about when I thought, okay, his fingernails need to soak in something. And I thought about soaking, and I thought about my teeth and how nice they look. So I got this stuff out and put half a cap full of the stain away in some warm water in a bowl. And he soaked his fingernails for about five minutes, maybe. And, like, I didn't have to clean them at all. Like, they cleaned themselves. They, they totally cleaned themselves. Um, it doesn't... It says keep out of reach of children, but I guess that's because they could eat it. I mean, and I think I threw the box away, so I don't know what stuff is really made out of, but it seems okay to me. Um, anyways, his nails were like really white and clean. They looked really fantastic. So I'm going to start using that for my fingernails because like being a mom, you kind of get down and dirty. Like I, I don't know how moms keep their fingernails done like nice and neat. Like you're doing dishes all day and like cleaning up crappy diapers and stuff. It's like... Yeah, so I'm going to be cleaning my, uh, my nails with the same stuff I clean my teeth with. That's like uh, two birds, one stone. So, one more thing. Um, given the fact that I'm a big, pretty big hypochondriac and I had a severe episode this week, I, um, I kind of am trying to eliminate anything unhealthy in my life, anything unnecessary. Um... So I, I started thinking about it and it's like, you know, I, I love my fix it -Ent powder. Like that is still like the number one for me. Like I hold it, you know, really dear in my heart. Um, cause it just works really good. It works really, really good, but it has zinc in it. And I just, you know, if, if they say it's bad for your health and they do like whoever they is, I like it whoever they are, what, the FDA, I don't know, anyways, um, then you should probably stay away from it, like, you know, I'm not telling anybody what to do, because I kept my fix it up, and, like, I really enjoy it, I'm really gonna be sad to see it go, but, like, it's just like with smoking, because I'm trying to quit smoking right now, too, um, and I'm really being, I'm very successful at it right now, like, I'm not, usually I smoke a pack a day, and, like, right now, I'm, like, down, like, five or six a day, which is, like, so good for me. If my husband were to just throw his cigarettes away and not come in the house smelling like a freaking ashtray, then I would quit. I'm gonna quit with, with or without him. I mean, I'm doing what I can, but anyways, it's, like, with anything bad for your health, like that you like, like you only are living in this moment and thinking, I like this right now. Like this is working for me. This is great. I like it right now. And you don't think down the road, you know, about tomorrow. Cause like to us, like tomorrow is like tomorrow. It's not here yet. So why worry about what's not here yet? Like we'll cross that bridge when we get there. Some people cross that bridge and it's like, it's too late because like, the damage has already been done. And I'm, I'm not saying I know what zinc does. I'm just talking about bad things in general. Things that you are advised not to do, to stay away from. I really recommend kicking all of those habits and getting rid of all of that nasty stuff in your life. Because, like, you know, people who end up dying of cancer, like, you know, 
it's hard to say you never seen it coming like you, you don't think that it's gonna happen to you but it could happen to you just like with your teeth like you know I'm sure if my parents had a crystal ball when I was a child and saw my future and knew that this is where I was headed at this early of an age, saw the kind of hell I would go through in my teenage years, I'm sure my teeth would have taken priority back then. But you just don't think that way. You don't see that. Like you, you just don't. You don't think about stuff like that. And you really need to. You really need to. So anything that's in your life that is like afflicting you right now, um, it's probably a good idea to get rid of it. So I'm not using anything with zinc in it anymore. Like, cause I don't know what it's gonna do to me, and I don't want to take any chances. I don't like the Polygrip powder compared to the fixident like I really don't like you can tell the difference to me you can really tell the difference like my mouth it's I don't know it's just I don't like it I just don't like it it's not the same consistency it's just not the same stuff like I feel like I'm kind of cheating on my product here but I mean you know it is what it is so that's what I'm using now I'm not using fixident anymore maybe I can find like an another use for my old fixinant powder. <laughs> Maybe I can do some products or projects with it. I don't know. Whatever. So that's that. Staying away is awesome. Stay away from zinc. Stop smoking. Just stop. Just stop. Stop right now because it's, it's never going to bring anything good. I think I'm going to do a video on my personal channel now. So that's that for tonight. Good night.